For kids, the company known for dubbing anime. Several anime includes One Piece, Sonic X, Shaman King, and many more. Well, when four kids dubbed the show, they all ended horribly. And that's who I'm going to be ranting about in this damn video. I am going to box four kids by ranting about it. First off, when we talk about One Piece, One Piece is the most overrated topic of censorship in 4Kids history. Now, first of all, I want to talk about the intro. Originally, you have Japanese pop music in the background music while the intro is going. Our version, the English American version, is rap. And I gotta say this. How the hell is rap associated with pirates? It doesn't make any freaking sense. It's... If it's what four kids call an intro, that is the worst intro I've seen in an anime show in my life. Curse you. Also, the censorship. Dear God, the censorship. The first censorship I saw, it's not big, but it was minor. I remember watching Pokemon when I was a little kid, and I saw rice balls. At first, I never knew what they were, until now, they were rice balls. In the show, they called it donuts. I thought to myself, if those donuts actually exist, well, they have those coconut uh, rice balls, whatever the heck they're called. They taste like coconut, and they're pretty bad. I think it's from Hostess, I think. But besides the point, um, uh, later on in the Pokemon series, they re-edited the Japanese food to guess what? The American food. I mean, what is wrong of putting Japanese food on there? It's irony having a having a show from Japan and reanimating it to have American food. It's irony. It doesn't make sense. It's like giving your dog cat food and he eats it. Besides the food censorship, there's violent censorship, blood censorship, sexual censorship, whatever you want to name it, they're all censored. One noticeable censorship is the hammer gun! Oh no! How horrible that one kid is being threatened by a hammer gun! Honestly, is that going to threaten a kid? Are you f f serious? Four kids is so stupid. That's the most. This it's the most ridiculous censorship excuse I've seen in my life. That pissed the f out of me. Oh, and do you remember the intro? The the American one. Here's one line of the course that really f pissed the f out of me. There's his name Solo. He's like samurai in a in a L A D Y. No, he's not shy. Oops, I was doing that Moxman thing. Sanji's cooking choppers. Doctoring. What the f God awful rhymes. Does four kids think that rap music is the only music we listen to? How dumb do you think we are? I hate rap in general. Here's what I think of rap. It sucks ass from a dock. That's why I think of rap. You rap homies. Go home smoke crack, dog. Another censorship I hate. The red wine scene. There's a scene in which four kids turn wine into blue wine. Oh, wait, but is it called Kool Aid? You replace it with Kool Aid! Are you f serious? That is another ridiculous cut. It would have, I'd rather, it's rather, I'd rather, rather be water than just blue Kool Aid. 
Oh my god! And they replaced Sanji's cigarette. What is this? What kind of censorship are you doing for kids? This is a Barney! One Piece is a teen show, for God's sake! I'd rather have it replaced it with a toothpick. Why can't you just put a toothpick? Oh, let me guess, you censored it because a toothpick can choke your throat, but you'd rather have it replaced with a lollipop! A mother effing lollipop! Are you f kidding me? And another one that pissed me off is. Remember that one scene where the midget clown is, in the Japanese version, he's black. Well, guess what? They turned, four kids turned him to white. Okay, there are two things that is messed up. One, we live in the United States, and four kids is part of the U.S., and blacks live here. Why did you turn him to white? It won't make sense. Are you making the show racist? Why can't you put blacks in there? It doesn't make sense. And two, what was the point of changing it? Or is honestly, I thought four kids was run by soccer moms, but now it's run by white power racist. And this just came up. If you did a rap introduction, which rap is inspired by blacks, then why did you s edit the character's black color? White. It doesn't make any f god sense at all. So if you were racist, you wouldn't put rap music in it. But no, you put it in there. But you also censored the midget's color of skin and made him white. Make up your f damn mind. And the cleavage censored. Kids are not gonna pay attention to cleavage. They don't f damn mind. They don't at all. They're not gonna pay attention to f cleavage. But no, workers has to censor that, so that kids have nothing to look at. They just watch the show for fun. That's all. That's fuck all. And I know this is off topic, but I'm a fan of Sonic, and ever since Sonic X been dubbed by four kids, a flood of Sonic games came in, and most of them sucked ass. They're shit. I heard it from a guy I know named. Spax 3, I think. He lost his 50 song because of that. And I think he replied to one of my comments. And I get the feeling that he's telling the truth. And that ever since Sonic X came along, a flood of bad Sonic games came in. So, uh, it's just... Four Kids is not be not only becoming a bad dubbing company, it's becoming a bad marketplace. But the only shows I know that's not going to be around by four kids is Pokemon which is run now by Touch Productions and One Piece which won't be lended to uh, Funimation. That's a good dubbing company. They dubbed uh, Dragon Ball Z, uh, Kodocha, uh Fruits Basket, Case Closed, I love that show, Negima, all that stuff. And Al Kant said something about how ch today's children are not reading books. Well, I found the answer to that. It's the f parents' fault. They're not teaching their kids how to read. The school's not the only place in which they can learn how to read. The parents has got to help their kids. They got to discipline them, and it's the parents' fault for not treating their kids right. And what I mean by that, I mean not teaching them how to read. And whatever excuse they give out, it's bullshit. There should they should be responsible for their kids. And I know going off topic with that. But, this was told by Al Khan, who has to be the CEO of four kids himself. Don't go blaming it on all the kids. It's bullshit excuse. And what he said really, seriously pissed the fuck out of me. He said that mongers are the cost to blame that kids read mangas and it's decreasing them to read. Al Khan, that is bullshit. It's, it's a ridiculous excuse, and mangas teach you ha how to read as well. Where the f*** did you get that information? 